Orn, the fire below the mountain, is a beefy tank who's ready to forge his own path. This demigod has a few tools at his disposal to help him ram his way into the fight. His first ability, Volcanic Rupture, creates a fissure on the rift, slowing enemies hit and spawning a magma pillar after a brief delay. Combo this with his third ability, Searing Charge, and headbutt foes into the terrain to knock them up. They'll never know what hit them. Move mountains and start team fights by summoning a massive elemental that will slow and brittle anyone caught in its path. Recast this ability to charge into the elemental, which redirects it to knock up opponents in a line. Since Orn likes to do things his way, his passive allows him to stay on the map and forge any items without going back to base. And once he reaches a certain level, forging items near an ally will grant them a charge that allows them to purchase an item anywhere on the map too. But don't worry, we're not putting the shopkeepers out of business. They'll still get their gold. We couldn't bring over the Ram God without his brother, right? Our second champion this patch is Volibear, the Relentless Storm. These two aren't polar opposites, but while Orn is a super tanky Baron laner, Volibear is a brawling Baron laner who's ready to claw his way to victory. To help him sink his paws into the fight, Volibear has powerful offensive abilities that let him get on top of his foes to deal damage with ease. Chase your opponents down and stun them with his first ability, Thundering Smash. Or initiate fights by storming out and leaping onto foes with Volibear's ultimate, Stormbringer. Once he hunts you down though, watch out. His damage can be unbearable. His passive, the Relentless Storm, grants Volibear extra attack speed, which eventually causes his attacks to deal bonus magic damage to enemies nearby. In tandem with his other abilities, you should have no problem mauling down anyone in your path. And since Orn and Volibear have a bit of history, if these two are up against each other in one of your games, there's a chance a Nemesis duel will trigger, similar to the one Kha'Zix and Rengar currently have. Which demigod will come out on top? There's only one way to find out. And last, but certainly not least, we're bringing over one last champion this patch. Swain, the Noxian Grand General, is ready to rule the mid lane with an iron fist, or demonic hand. With this mage, you'll be able to plot, plan, and envision a path to victory for your team. The bread and butter to Swain's kit is his third ability, Never Move. Use this to launch your demonic power at your opponents and root them in place. Once they're in your grasp, you can pull them closer or leave them at bay. Whatever you choose, make sure to follow up with Swain's second ability, Vision of Empire. It will do more damage to enemies who are CC'd, making it a great tool to have in your arsenal to ensure your foes truly feel your wrath. Ascend to your final form and lead your team into the front lines of the fight with Swain's ultimate. Demonic Ascension lets Swain truly enter demon mode. Suck the life from any enemy champions, minions, or neutral monsters that dare step up to you. And if anyone gets too close, decimate and slow them with a Nova of Soulfire by casting Demon Flare.